Welcome back to another AI Practitioner Exam Bite, reviewing the question from the previous episode asking which of the following best describes how Retrieval Augmented Generation, or RAG, with Amazon Bedrock Knowledge Bases could address this need. The correct answer is D. It enables the chatbot to access and utilize the latest product documentation stored in the knowledge base when generating responses. Retrieval Augmented Generation RAG with Amazon Bedrock Knowledge Bases enables the chatbot to access and utilize the latest product documentation stored in the knowledge base when generating responses. The knowledge base can be updated with the latest product documentation, ensuring the chatbot always has access to current information. This makes it really an ideal solution for handling frequently changing data in a customer service context. Okay. In today's episode, we are covering the exam objective, identify AWS services that help store embeddings within vector databases. For example, Amazon OpenSearch service, Amazon Aurora, Amazon Neptune, Amazon DocumentDB with MongoDB compatibility, Amazon RDS for PostgreSQL. In our last episode, we talked about retrieval augmented generation or RAG and how Bedrock Knowledge Base can enhance your AI applications. So today we're diving into a related topic, AWS services that help store embeddings within vector databases. Before we jump into the services, let's quickly recap what embeddings are. We discussed this in a previous episode, but let's go through it again now. Embeddings are numerical representations of data, like text or images, that capture their semantic meaning. They're crucial for many AI applications, including RAG systems we pre discussed previously. Vector databases are specialized databases designed to store and efficiently query these embeddings. They're essential for scaling AI applications that work with large amounts of unstructured data. And AWS offers several services that support vector database capabilities. Let's break them down. The first is Amazon Open Search Service. This is a fully managed search and analytics engine, which now supports vector search, making it great for storing and querying embeddings at scale. We have Amazon Aurora, particularly Aurora PostgreSQL, which now includes the PG vector extension, allowing you to store and query vector embeddings directly in your relational database. There's Amazon Neptune. While primarily a graph database, Neptune now offers vector search capabilities, making it suitable for AI applications that need both graph and vector operations. Amazon DocumentDB. This is a MongoDB compatible database which supports vector search, allowing you to store and query embeddings alongside your document data. And finally, Amazon RDS for PostgreSQL. Similar to Aurora, RDS for PostgreSQL also supports the PG vector extension, giving you vector search capabilities in a managed PostgreSQL environment. Now, I want to mention just one more that wasn't on that list at the beginning, and that's Amazon Kendra. Now, while not strictly a vector database, Kendra is an intelligent search service that uses machine learning, including vector embeddings, to improve search results. It's particularly useful for enterprise search scenarios and can complement other vector database solutions. Now, the choice between these services depends on your specific use case, but here's a rough guide. Use OpenSearch if you need powerful search and analytics capabilities alongside vector search. Choose Aurora or RDS for PostgreSQL if you want to integrate vector search into your existing relational database workflows. Opt for Neptune if you need both graph and vector capabilities. Or go with DocumentDB if you're working with document data and want to add vector search to your MongoDB compatible database. And consider Kendra for intelligent enterprise search that leverages machine learning and vector embeddings to understand context and deliver highly relevant results. But whatever you choose, remember the ability to efficiently store and query embeddings is crucial for many AI applications, including the RAG systems we discussed in our previous episode. By understanding these AWS services, you'll be well equipped to design and implement scalable AI solutions. Let's do a review question. Which AWS service would be most suitable for an application that needs to store and query vector embeddings alongside document data and requires MongoDB compatibility? A, Amazon Aurora, B, Amazon Neptune, C, Amazon DocumentDB, or D, 
Amazon RDS for PostgreSQL. Post your answer into the comments and we'll review in the next episode where we'll be considering the cost trade-offs of various approaches to foundation model customization. As always, if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to follow, like, or subscribe, and how about even telling your friends about it? See you in the next video.